Uh, DJ, just settled on the two Newcastle matches then. Um, after the debrief, how have we kind of rated those performances? Um, yeah, generally quite happy. Um, we were just a bit disappointed in the second game. We didn't adapt to um, a couple of things we saw in the first game. Obviously, the first game, quite good in attack. I think we our game has matured a bit. Um, great, great control from our halfbacks and then allowed the boys up front to shine. So, um, overall, overall quite happy, but just second game, we just didn't adapt as well as we'd like to. Yeah, after such a long break, how good was it just to actually be playing that now again? Yeah, brilliant. The weeks leading up to the game, we had that bit, bit of excitement, something to aim towards. Um, a really new focus for the boys. So yeah, it's been it's been great to have two games done and then two more to come now. So we're really looking forward to it. Yeah, personally, you started both at 15. Um, please. Yeah, yeah, quite happy. Um, as I said, second game we we could have adapted adapted a bit better, but um, I think our game in general has, has improved a lot. Um, some great work put it, put in in pre season. We saw that come to fruition in in some of the games. So that's something we'll look to lead on and come into the Bristol games now. Yeah, potentially an obvious statement, but are we in a better place? Yeah, yeah, for sure. We've we've tested some of our um, some things we've been working on against each other, but once you test against opposition, that's when you really learn um, what's going well or what things we need to change. So no, we're happy with what we've worked on and um, just a couple of improvements going into the next two games. Yeah, Bristol home and away now. Anything in particular we're looking at? Um, we're obviously they're going to play a different style of rugby to Newcastle, so a good good chance for us to adapt to different styles. Um, we can adapt our game uh, to play in different different conditions um, and different styles of play. So the main thing for us is being able to adapt to whoever we're playing. So we're looking forward to that challenge this weekend. Yeah, what are we expecting from them? They tend to be quite expansive and attacking. Don't they? Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. We're looking for a big attacking threat. Uh, we've been prepping that during the week, um, and we're just a bit disappointed we didn't take a couple of our chances in the Newcastle game. So we'll be looking to move the ball around as well and um, test ourselves against one of the Premiership's best. Yeah, in your third year here now, um, lots of new arrivals. How does this squad compare to the previous, in your opinion? Yeah, it, fe it feels quite settled. Um, I think we have a core core group of guys who've been here for a few years and a couple of experienced um, heads joined the group. So no, if, if Feels uh, feels quite settled. I, th I think we our game has matured a lot. As I said, a lot of understanding of um, what we need to do in what areas of the pitch and how we can best um, exploit our strengths and um, really push forward this year. Yeah, just finally having to wait patiently, obviously, for news on the championship. So those Newcastle games just give us a kind of taste of that competitive edge again. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, I think guys, as I said, stepped up training during the week, just having that focus of something to look forward to and, and really test ourselves. Um, We've pushed each other in training a lot, but once once you play against a hard opposition, that's when you really learn more about yourself and as a team.